Hey everybody, Ken Jamaica with Team Jamaica Real Estate and WeHeartRoseville.com. I'm here with the lovely Tiffany Anaya, glad I didn't screw that up again, um, with The Flower Garage. Yep, that's me. In high school, I kind of wanted to take the easy way out, so I did the whole ROP Got thing, it. Yeah, yeah. which was, you know, three courses of the day, and I ended up really liking it and actually kind of doing good at it, so right. um, that's where it started. It kind of fizzled after high school. I got married at 21, so I had to get a real job. Yeah, I played um, that game. Yeah. So, and then finally, at a certain point, I was able to get back into it, F and on, through the last... 20 years and and once I finally moved to Roseville about a year and a half ago I got to really go for it go for the gold awesome so, so what flowers so you think weddings funerals prom every day every day every day birthday everything my you know bread and butter for me is weddings that's my favorite and this sounds odd but funerals I like funerals I don't know I feel like I can like pour my love into the flowers for people my stepdaughter lived here okay and we really liked the area it reminded us a lot well it reminded me because my fiance or I'm sorry my husband husband a, a month um he is uh he wasn't from the Bay, but anyway, I really felt like it was a lot like San Ramon, Pleasanton area. I don't, I think this is kind of dumb, but I took my driver's test on a stick shift. And I don't That's think fantastic. I, and I was like bound to determine to take my driver's test on a stick shift. hundred percent. I don't know. That's kind of a cool thing. That, that is, a th well, <laughs> now it's an amazing thing. Okay, I get the draw for online because it's easy, and we all do it when we're, especially right now. Mm -hmm. uh, but as a small business, shopping local helps small people. It helps their livelihood. And, um, and literally, literally small people. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> children, exactly, yeah. yep. Um, and you know, sometimes you may pay a few more dollars, but you're definitely helping out, you know, uh, like a family or, you know, that whole, you're paying for Little League uniforms, not someone's summer house. Exactly. You know, honestly, I think they can all mesh well together. I think it's just all how you how you do it. And you okay. kind of, I honestly think you have, have the eye for it. Oh, 100%. I mean, I, um, they all look beautiful together. Garnigas. Why? Uh, because they brown very easily when you touch them. People always want them for corsages, so you're hugging and then they get crunched and they're brown and they fall apart. <laughs> you can Ew. do all this extra stuff to them, but honestly, it's really not, it's just not worth it. If you really want them, home, do it, but I'm probably gonna charge a lot <laughs> with a disclaimer. Usually roses. Okay. Well, that's um, you know that's an easy one. <laughs> yep, they're hardy. Um, orchids are pretty hardy too. People might not think that they do crunch easy, but they're pretty hardy as far as not getting um, uh, dehydrated and droopy. Valentine's Day is exciting. That is val. That is exciting. And I'm excited that I feel like uh, the county's opening up again. As of 5 p.m. yesterday? Yes, and I'm hoping that, um, of course, I want everyone to be safe and healthy, but it's exciting for weddings, um, because yeah. I had like eight last year that had to transfer over to this year. So I'm super excited. I have like 15 booked this year. Wow. Yeah, so um, that's super exciting, and brides can reach out. I still have a lot of dates available. Not to worry about what everyone thinks. I mean, I know it's so hard. That's impossible um, when you're a senior. It's impossible. <laughs> it's impossible. It is absolutely impossible. But really try to take a lot of that with a grain of salt because it's really not going to matter. Right? The second you graduate, it doesn't matter anymore. I mean, just be who you are. I think it's um, for years. Every summer we would go up to Downeyville, okay. Sierra, Nevada. Mm -hmm. I think that's where it was. Yeah, um, and from that way. That way, yes. And the funny thing is, now that we drive through that area, now like it was no big deal when I was a kid. It was like this 
forever long four hour trip up there, but great memories. And the camper, my brother and I <laughs> telling jokes and being silly and my cousins went, my grandparents went, we would go every summer, we'd rent a cabin on the river. And it was just, I just have really fond memories of that. Kind. I do remember that question. I want to remember just kind. Um, kind, giving, caring, no matter what color, you know, purple, red, green, who you were. Um, just a good hearted, kind person. Cared about everyone. That, that's all. I do the most via Facebook and Instagram. Okay. I do have a website, but I feel like that's just, honestly, it's just to, to be legit and have a website and look, you know, um, professional. 